I'm Tammy Gibbs with Lovins Realty in Vidalia, Georgia, and on today's episode of Sweet Vidalia Home, we're going to be chatting about three popular loan programs so that you have more information when you start to get pre-qualified. So stay tuned. I'll be right back. <laughs> Welcome back to Sweet Vidalia Home. I'm Tammy Gibbs with Lovins Realty in Vidalia, Georgia, and on today's episode, I'm going to be chatting with you about three popular loan programs, FHA, USDA, and VA loans. The reason that these programs are popular is because they offer a low or no down payment option for the buyers. So I hope that you'll come away with lots of information that will be helpful to you in your home buying experience. So let's get started. Today I'm chatting with you about loans and what you need to know to better prepare yourself before you go and get pre-qualified. So I hope this will be of service to you and that you'll learn lots and you'll have a better uh, buying experience when you go to buy your home. So today we're talking about FHA, USDA, and VA loans. And so I'm going to have some slides for you um, that are going to give you a little bit more information. But I just wanted to kind of informally chat with you for a few minutes. Um, when it comes to loans, what you don't know can actually hurt you. Um, a lot of times, uh, if you don't know about a particular loan program, you're at risk of actually sabotaging your purchasing experience or even perhaps um, wasting money, you know, paying money for appraisals and for inspections and then um, getting to a point where you, the house that you're, you've picked out doesn't qualify for that particular loan and you're out all of that money because you just didn't know that in, in advance. So that's kind of what my purpose for today's video is, is to actually give you a little bit more information so that when you do go to get pre-qualified, you'll know what to ask for and know how um, those particular loan programs work. Now, this is a disclaimer. I am not a, a lender representative, and that is not my expertise. So all of the information that you see, I'm going to be crediting in my slides, and is basically based on my experience over the years with the different loan programs. So it's very basic information, but I do advise you to seek um, more information from the particular uh, lenders that you're going to work with. So let's just kind of get that out of the way because um, I definitely don't want people to think I know more than what I do. But um, these basics will definitely help you. Most people who haven't bought a house in a while don't realize that not only do they have to qualify for a loan, but the house also has to qualify. If you're in the market for a fixer-upper, this information is vital. You cannot depend on lenders or agents to necessarily tell you this up front. I do, but not all do as much pre-education. What this means is that if a house needs a lot of work, it probably won't qualify for FHA, VA, or USDA. So if you put a contract in on a house that needs work and the loan program is any of these, then if the house doesn't qualify, due to the condition you have wasted your inspection and appraisal money. So knowing more about what disqualifies a house is just a smart way to approach the situation. Let's look at a few of the things that may disqualify a home for one of these loans. Broken windows, flaking and peeling paint, missing appliances and light fixtures are some of the most common reasons that a house won't qualify. Now let me pause to say I'm not a lender and what I'm discussing today is based on my experience and understanding and I'm not a loan expert. I will always recommend that you seek out confirmation on these loan programs with a qualified lender's representative. Things change often in lending and everything is subject to change. Having said that, knowing some of the basics will still be helpful to you. So if these loans are harder to come by, why do people use them? Simply put, all three offer low to no down payment and they make it possible for many to obtain the, their dream of owning their own home. So what is an FHA loan? The Federal Housing Administration, generally known as FHA, provides mortgage insurance on loans made by FHA approved lenders throughout the United States and its territories. 
FHA insures mortgages on single-family homes, multifamily properties, residential care facilities, and hospitals. It is one of the largest insurers of mortgages in the world, insuring more than 46 million mortgages since its inception in 1934. FHA Mortgage Insurance provides lenders with protection against losses if a property owner defaults on their mortgage. The lenders bear less risk because FHA will pay a claim to the lender for the unpaid principal balance of a defaulted mortgage. Loans must meet certain requirements established by FHA to qualify for insurance. Here are some highlights of FHA loans. Down payment is typically 3.5% of purchase price. You will still need money for closing costs, and sometimes these can be negotiated with the seller. You and the house have to qualify for the loan, and there are some FHA special loans that will allow for renovations, but they are different and better discussed in a different video. What is a USDA loan? This no down payment 100% financing program assists approved lenders in providing low and moderate income households the opportunity to own adequate, modest, decent, safe, and sanitary dwellings as their primary residence in eligible rural areas. Eligible applicants may purchase existing homes, which may include costs to rehabilitate, improve, or relocate the dwelling or build new. USDA provides a loan note guaranteed to approved lenders, encouraging participation by minimizing their risk. This program is not restricted to first-time home buyers. Here are some highlights of USDA loans. They require no down payment. You will still have closing costs, but sometimes these can be negotiated with the seller. And these loans are only available in certain areas. And remember, these houses must meet certain criteria. What is a VA loan? A VA loan is a loan that is available to military who meet certain eligibility requirements. How VA-backed home loans work is that the VA-backed home loan is guaranteed or a portion of the loan that you get from a private lender is guaranteed against foreclosure. This guarantee allows the lender to recover some or all of their losses if you should default on your loan. Since there's less risk for the lender, they're more likely to give you the loan under better terms. In fact, nearly 90% of all VA-backed loans are made without a down payment. Lenders follow VA standards when making VA-backed home loans. They may also require you to meet additional standards before giving you a loan. These standards may include having a high enough credit score or getting an updated home appraisal or an expert's estimate of the value of your home. Here are some highlights of VA loans. These are only available to military who meet certain eligibility requirements. In most situations, they require no down payment and you will still have closing costs that can sometimes be negotiated with the seller. And don't forget, these houses also must meet certain criteria. Knowledge is power, and that's one of the reasons that I make these educational videos. I want you as the consumer to be knowledgeable in all of the home buying process and know all of the options available to you. So I hope that today's episode on FHA, USDA, and VA loans has been helpful and will continue to serve you on your home buying journey. But if you happen to be in the Vidalia, Georgia area and are looking for a real estate professional, I'd love to talk with you. My information is in the comments and also at the end of the video. I'm Tammy Gibbs and this has been Sweet Vidalia Home and I'll see you next time.